Hi, this is Wes Fryer, and today I'm going to talk a little bit about how to use the program Scratch and how the broadcast block can be used to uh, have um, sprites communicate together. So over here I'm going to click to get a surprise sprite, and now I've got a, uh, looks like a hat that's over here with my cat, and I need to have some scripts to uh, have these 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 cats or these objects do some things so um, I will come under control and say when the green flag is clicked I'm gonna want my cat to move to a particular place so I'm going to um, move my cat to let's let's just move him over here minus 194 0 so I'm gonna say minus 194 0 and if I want to see what that looks like Ah, look at that! I moved my hat, so maybe I'll I can duplicate that so that that happens with my cat too, and that's going to be a little too high. So what um, what I want to do is uh, maybe I'll move my cat, and then um, uh, when something else happens, the hat can move over there. So instead of saying when the when the hat uh, when the green flag is clicked, I can say when I receive. Okay. When I receive that, I want the the hat to go to a place. So, what else would I want my cat to do? Well, maybe he's going to uh, move across the screen. So, let's have him glide, and let's have him take two seconds to glide, and then let's have him go up here to the corner. One ninety, one forty four. Okay. So, let's see what that looks like. The cat's going to glide up there. That's a little bit too high, so let's have him go to 74. Okay. When he reaches this point, I'd like the hat to go over here on top of him. The way that I'm going to do that, and there's different methods of this, is I'm going to have him send a broadcast. Okay. The broadcast is like a scene change, and I'm going to say, ready for hat. I could have said scene one, I could say whatever I want, but he's going to glide up there, and then he says, ready for hat. Over here, this action is going to happen when ready for hat is broadcast. So when the, when the hat, which I can make this a name, when this receives ready for hat, then it's going to um, it's going to go over here. And what and what I think I might do is instead of this go to, let's make it glide over there. Okay. And the hat, if he's going to be over here on the cat, looks like 192, 134. So 192. What do we say? 134. All right. Let's give this a try. I'm going to click my green flag. My Hat glides over there. Oh, and there the hat goes. What do you think about the hat? A little bit too low. We'll move that up a little bit. Let's instead of 134, let's make it uh, 139. Okay, and I'll change my positions. So this is just a real simple script, just movement of two things, but it's using the broadcast flag, and that's one way that you can have motion in your project or you, not just motion you trigger events to happen based on the broadcast broadcast flag okay um, to find out more information about scratch you can go to the website scratch.mit.edu and click on support and they've got lots of other places that will teach you new things about scratch